This demo is about deploying Windows 11 using Windows Autopilot in Microsoft Endpoint Manager. First step. Clean installation of Windows 11. Windows 11 Insider Preview was used. During the installation our test user, LeeGU, has joined the Windows client to the domain. We are using Azure Active Directory. Windows Autopilot device registration can be done within your organization by manually collecting the hardware identity of devices, hardware hashes, and uploading this information in a comma-separated value (CSV) file. You can use the get-windowsautopilotinfo.ps1 script on a brand new installation. A few actions for the initial configuration will be required. When the CSV file is ready, I am able to upload it into Endpoint Manager. To enable Autopilot I have defined a Windows Autopilot deployment profile, setting a few options including a template for the generation of a machine name, with some random characters that will be added every time. The deployment profile will be applied to all the users and all the devices. I have assigned the test user has a primary user for the device. The primary user is used within Microsoft Intune to map a licensed user to a device. That enables the user to see the device in the Company Portal app in the Company Portal website, and also enables the user to perform self-service actions on that device. When a device has no primary user assigned, the Company Portal app detects it as a shared device. Using device management I have wiped the device. You will get the warning that factory reset returns the device to its default settings, along with that you will be having two more options to select. Wipe device, but keep enrollment state and associated user account option. Wipe device, and continue to wipe even if device loses power. If we check the box for first setting to wipe device, but keep enrollment state, this option will not delete the data which is saved outside of the user profile. Otherwise, all data, apps, and settings will be removed. That is the option I selected. After the wipe, the installation starts directly with a work installation profile and offers login with the assigned user. Windows Autopilot uses the OEM optimized version of Windows. This version is pre-installed on the device, so you don't have to maintain custom images and drivers for every device model. The following configuration are possible. Apply settings and policies. Install company applications. Change the addition of Windows. After the deployment is complete, you can use either Intune, Configuration Manager or other tools to manage these devices. At the moment available only in preview, a new Windows Autopilot Diagnostics page will offer additional details about the whole process.